you're welcome to browse text on youtube channel and um, in today's video i'm going to be showing you how to link a debit card or credit card to your paypal account regardless of which type of paypal account you are operating if you have a card that you want to link to the paypal then i'm going to show you right in this video how you can do that without any form of issue so uh, if you have created a paypal account and wondering how you can link a debit card or credit card with it then in this video guide i will show you how to link a debit card to your PayPal account, how to link a credit card to your PayPal account, the difference between the debit, yes, you might be wondering what is the difference between the credit and debit card, like Visa card right now is a, is a prepaid card and the credit card at the same time, and the MasterCard is a debit card, so I'm going to show you if you link a debit card, the difference between the two and everything you need to know as far as linking card with PayPal is concerned. So that is why that is what I'm going to be showing you right in this video. So you are welcome to this channel. If you're coming across this channel for the very first time, or you've been watching our videos in the past but but haven't subscribed to this channel, kindly do that right now. Click on the subscription button and subscribe to this YouTube channel so that whenever we drop a new video guide, you'll be the first to get notified that we drop a new video. Thank you. <laughs>
so let me just check it with the optional method i'm having with my phone here so i will be using uh, let me just use the mobile um we're having network issues so the correct cvv is what I, i'm waiting for right now okay so this is the correct cvv get details so the correct cvv is um um so let me enter the correct cvv so that's the correct cvv so um, in the space provided for billing address you will see add new address click on the add new address button so this is the add new address button then you are going to click on this plus sign this plus icon here you will click on it so once you click on it you will be able to add the new address so this is the address um then the address provided for you in the um in your billing details on the truth um, card so that's what you will be filling here so address line that i'm having here is um let me choose address line one So that's the billing um, details that I'm having. The I will, I will edit city. So which city is there? Then I will impute the correct city, the state of province, which is the state. Then I will enter it as required. The post the poster code. The poster code. Then I'm going to enter the poster code that I'm having here, which is. All these details there with your truth card. Once you click on get details, you will get every details. So you will have to save it, then click on add address button. So once you click on the add address button, the address will be there. Then you will navigate back to your to the page where you are linking the card. Let's navigate back to the card area. Um, okay, so the this uh, the process has been interrupted, so I will have to start again. So let me start again. But we have successfully add the billing address, so we, we just have to just do it one more time. So, but we successfully add the the address. Okay, so that's the card number. Mastercard is there. The expiry date is um, so that's the expiry date. The security code that will enter the security code. One. Okay, so the billing address here, the new address should have been added here. So I will select it. So once I select it, then I will click on link card. Can you see it here? So can you see? So you link master debit card successfully. As, as you can see on my screen right here, I've been able to link the card successfully. I've been able to link the card successfully. So right now, I've been able to show you how to get your truth card. I've been able to show you live how to link your truth card to your PayPal account. So right and after linking the card to the PayPal, you know, it's soon it shows sure successful uh, notification, but we haven't confirmed the card. So right now we have to confirm the card. As you can see on my screen right here, when I scroll down, so this is the card I'm having on my account. And this is the one that we are trying to link right now. So all I have to do is to click on confirm card. So whenever you want to um, this thing, whenever you want to confirm your card. So all you have to do is to come to this page and you will see the card. You will see confirm button there. Then you click on this confirm. But before we click on this button. Um, when you want to confirm your card, you uh, PayPal will charge you two dollar. So you have to make this two dollar available in your card on your card before you'll be able to initiate this transaction. So so far we have known this. We don't need to stress ourselves. So right now the next thing is to navigate to our um, Truth account and um, fund the card with um, minimum of two dollar. 
I want to go and fund my truth card with two dollar right now. So I'm um, okay. You're welcome back, guys. So this is the deposit that I made earlier, and um, the deposit has um, the payment is completed right now. And um, as you can see on my screen right here, you were given that I dropped the so this is the 2k that I deposited earlier. So this is the notification, and this is the equivalent amount and um, in USD. So um, okay can you see this so this is the, the deposit is completed right now so this is my card balance right now so i'm having 3.31 dollar on my card balance right now so the next thing is to log into my paypal account so this is my paypal account then i will scroll down once i scroll down then i will see this card um that i want to confirm then i will see the confirm option on the card then i'm going to click on the confirm so once i click on the confirm i'm going to be redirected to the next page and then on the next page then I will see confirm your card. So I will click on the confirm your card button. So once I click on confirm your card button, I will select get a code. So can you see a code is on its way? It should appear on your card statement within five to seven business days. Can you see? So I will have to wait right now to get the code. So immediately I receive the code, I will resume this video and keep you guys updated where i received the code how the code arrived and um, the next thing is to enter the code immediately we enter the code then our card is verified you can now proceed to uh sending money and receiving money with the card like withdrawing from our paypal to the truth card so right now i'm going to click on done so immediately i click on done i'll be directed back to my dash um to my dashboard so can you see this is code can you see this is the enter code to confirm your card can you see so this is the button that I will, I, will, I will click immediately i receive the code but i'm yet to receive the code so i'm yet to receive the code so immediately i receive the code i'm going to come back to the confirm to the card confirmation page and um, i will click on this enter code option so i will click on this option to confirm the card welcome back so in the in the last section where we post this video um we are about to confirm our debit card linkage with the paypal account but we are waiting for a particular code to confirm the card so right now i've gotten the code right now and i will see this is notification confirm your debit card so i will i have to click see details so once i click see details i will see the prompt that i will click so as to can you see so give it a nickname can you see enter code to confirm your card so i will click on the enter code to confirm card can you see this is four digit code Within 24 hours, they provide me with the notification. That notification, whenever you when you want to confirm your card, whenever they deduct the amount they want to deduct for card verification, the notification that you receive for that debit transaction, that's where the code will be included. As you can see, this the payment with this merchant. Can you see this is PP2112 code? Can you see this 2112 is the code that 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 is delaying me since so all i have to do right here is to copy this code once i copy this code then i will navigate back to my paper wallet so the code it will be different you know, in your own case so just make sure you follow the project that i followed right now to make sure you insert the correct code so that you won't have any problem so right now i'll paste the code so i'll paste the code can you see we charge 1.95 can you see confirm the four digit code that appears on your card activities next to the charge amount can you see so this is the code oh okay let me type it okay so i will click on confirm button so we're waiting for the card can you see your master debit card has been confirmed and that's all we have been able to confirm the card guys Successfully link the card to our wallet right here. So right now, um, I said I will be letting you know the difference between these two cards. As you can see right here, so both cards are present on my dashboard right here. So this is a Mastercard and this is a debit card. A lot of people are asking because in my previous guide, uh, when you check browsertext.com and you read our guide on how to link 
how to create a valid paypal account i advise all the individuals to get an afri card a, a visa card which is the one i'm I, I hear that is about to expire here so this is an afri card so i i advise everyone to get that card so as to link it to their paypal account but a lot of individuals that say in browser section can we link another card and i link another card and it works it is like that so it's not that it's only africa that you can link with your paypal account but not all card will work with paypal account and um, there is difference between debit card and credit card you can see as i link the mastercard right here this is a debit card and as i link an africa can you see this is a prepaid card meaning a get a, 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 a credit card because i can load it from online i can load the card directly from paypal so the reason why i said you should link africa is because with this africa you will be able to withdraw from your paypal account to your bank account immediately you click on transfer you'll be able to transfer any amount in your paypal balance to your card and you'll be able to use this card to withdraw naira i think you understand what i'm talking about right now so the difference between a credit card and debit card is that debit card can only perform a debit transaction so when you link a debit card for um on paypal so you can only use it maybe you set a payment preference so when you check a payment preference you will see let me check let me show you what i'm talking about so payment preference let me show you this okay can you see set it set as oh sorry i've mistakenly okay no problem so can you see more about payment preference so click on it can you see so this is what you can use the card to to do so maybe you want to pay online and there's no um enough money on your paypal or your paypal balance then they can charge the card directly and then use it for the service you are about to order i hope you understand what i'm talking about but with the credit card you will be able to withdraw from your paypal to your nigerian bank account or whichever card you link so if you want to link a credit card to the to the paypal you'll be able to link that if you want to link a debit card you'll be able to link the debit card but debit card you cannot use it to withdraw from paypal to your nigerian bank account i hope you understand what i'm talking about right now so not all nigerian bank um card will work with paypal but mastercard should work visa card will work and um it is later so if you have any card that you intend linking with paypal just go ahead and link it if it works fine but if it doesn't work um fine so if you're watching this video from nigeria i recommend you getting a africa card if you want to withdraw directly to uh, to your nigeria bank account so that you'll be able to withdraw to the card and um from the card maybe you can transfer it to your account or withdraw directly so that is that about that if you are working from other parts of the world maybe you, you are working outside nigeria so you can just link any credit card that is compatible with the paypal account so immediately you are linking the card that i've shown you during the linking process the credit alert that they will send to you the debit alert rather so when you when you want to confirm the card you'll be debited with some amount of money as i've explained so the code needed will come with the debit alert so that's where you get the debit alert. to buttress my point let me click on transfer here. as you can see right here i'm having two cards here which is visa and a mastercard debit card so if this is my balance and if i should click on transfer money right now i want to withdraw you will see that i will not see the debit card here so let's wait for it to display so can you see hope you can see right here so this is the visa transfer us to that too so i'll be able to transfer it to this visa and immediately i transfer it to the visa card it will appear on my card immediately but i think you can you i i think you can see my withdrawal page right now I, I cannot see the debit card there it's only when you want to make payment with paper that's when the debit card will appear so that is that about that guys um if you're still having any question after watching this video you can drop it in the comment section of this video and i'll be glad to provide a response for you as soon as possible thanks for watching and do have a wonderful day